So like, since today doesn't seem so busy, I was thinking that I would probably try and head out in a few. Is that okay with you? On a Friday? We're usually the busiest on Fridays. Is there any way you could just stay for a few more hours? I'm already really behind on some of my tasks. My ride is supposed to be here within an hour, so we'll just have to see if they can come later, but no promises. I really just don't know what to do, David. Rebecca does not care about this place at all. She's leaving early to go out and party. At this point, you should just let her leave. She's going to whine and complain all night if she stays. I've grown up with her, trust me. Well, you know, I guess you're right. You do know her best. But, ugh, your sister sure is annoying sometimes. Tell me about it. Well, my shift is almost over, so catch you tomorrow. All right, hope you have a good one. At this point, Rebecca, I don't see the need for you to stay anymore, so you can leave. All right, well, thanks. My ride's here, so I'll catch you later, hun bun. Who needs her anyway? Are you kidding me? Wow, David seriously just said that to get Rebecca out of work. I've been sitting at my table for 20 minutes. Where's my server? Yes, me too. This place has awful service. I think it's time I use the efficiency perspective because the utilitarian approach is just not working anymore. I can't take it anymore. This is completely unfair. Hello, this is Mr. Rogers. Who is this? Mr. Rogers? It's Harriet from the pub. We're in a bit of a situation. Rebecca has left early and one of our servers called out and, and, Say no more. I will be there within half an hour. We can talk later tonight and work this out. Hang in there. Both. I can, I can just explain the whole thing later. Thank you.